Welcome to Upper Michigan Source Weather on Demand. I'm meteorologist Carl Bonac. Officially on Monday, temperatures cooled back over Sunday when it was 92 officially at the National Weather Service site near Nagani. Monday's high 82. It was still warm and humid at night, a low of 65. There was actually a record precipitation of 81 hundredths of an inch. Some spots had up to two and a half inches of rain Sunday night into Monday morning. The record high 92 degrees. Here's the pattern on Tuesday. A big hot upper level high pressure ridge will still be centered over the central plains and to the north. A weak frontal boundary that helps set off our initial area of thunderstorms will be just to the south in northern Wisconsin. That's where the heavy thunderstorms will develop and it looks like we'll be right on the edge of those showers and thunderstorms. The best chance will be in the southwestern UP, especially in the morning along the Wisconsin line. This front gets suppressed a little bit to the south. Weak high pressure builds in from the north. It's not going to cool off all that much, but it does look like the coolest readings will be near Lake Superior with a light northerly wind, and there could be a lot of low clouds, especially Wednesday morning, particularly over the northern UP. Then this weak area of high pressure settles through the Great Lakes, and the hot weather will continue south of this warm front. As a uh, Another disturbance moves up and warmer air tries to come in with a lot of moisture on the back side of this high. There is a chance by late on Thursday of some more showers, especially over the western UP. Your TV six day forecast. Look for temperatures to still be on the warm side. No extreme heat expected, and there is a chance of some scattered showers and thunderstorms even into the beginning of the Labor Day weekend.